And look at this, look at this. Oh my gosh, they have a plush. Hold on, I gotta get them out, hold on. guys today we are in O'Fallon Missouri at this ginormous spirit Halloween which apparently used to be a shop and save O'Fallon eh? do you think we'll find Jimmy O'Fallon in here or is it O'Fallon like I've fallen and I can't get up Anyway, Spirit Halloween in O'Fallon Missouri did I say Missouri earlier if I didn't I meant to look at the size of that Spirit Halloween sign. Let's go in and see what we can find. Thank you, automatic doors. Oh my gosh, am I glad it's much cooler in here. Now hold on a second, guys. Oh, there's cardboard over those doors. I was gonna try to take a little peek because as you know, I used to film abandoned retail locations, so I love it. Look who we have right up front. It's the straw man. Holy crap, guys, look at this. I love this guy. Okay, I'll shut up so you can hear what he's saying. I love him so much, and I love how he just keeps on talking. Look at this tall, skinny drink of water. Come on, sir, say it again. I definitely have to buy this guy this year. And then we have Lord Farquaad, who we've seen about 38 times now, I believe. If you guys don't know, I'm on the tour to film 100 Spirit Halloween stores this season. And one of the only reasons I don't get tired of seeing these stores is because I know that in just a couple months they're all going away and we won't get to see this setup ever again unless it's in somebody's house who has bought all this stuff. All right, we definitely have to have some stickers right here for Mr. Straw Man. And let's go right ahead through here. Look at this, this is funny. We have Grim over here this time and the bog zombie over here. What if we stepped on the bog zombies uh, thing here and then he started making sounds like Grim? Well, I guess that's not gonna happen. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead over here and see Grim. What if we stepped on Grim and he started making bog zombie sounds? Oh, he's making his own sounds, but he's not moving. I'm sorry, sir, that you were frozen in a cryogenic chamber. All right, let's make our way over here real quick and see Mr. Monty. Will you talk to us? Oh, this has got to be the quietest Monty I have seen in any store, guys. I mean, except for the ones that aren't working. Still looking for that blue and purple mask. However, I am in stores today that are... I mean, these stores are only about 15 miles apart, so they're probably all waiting for the same trucks. I just cannot wait till I walk in this store and I see the blue and the purple mask and I can grab it and I can say, it's mine. This is so unfair too, because I want spirit pajamas. What do they think I am, a skinny guy? Whoa, look at this. I don't know if I've seen this before. A spirit beanie. What the heck, that's 13, I might have to get that. That is pretty cool, except for this extra little string. Where did you come from, Mr. String? Are you a ghost? Wait a minute, look at this. I know I'm getting sidetracked, but look what we have here. The Trick or Treat Sam Knife. This is pretty dang cool. Honestly, I don't know if I've seen this in any other stores. You guys are gonna have to tell me, because these knives, there's one for Ghostface, there's one for Michael Myers, and there's one for Trick or Treat here, obviously, and I don't think I've seen it in other stores. All right, before we get too far off track, let's go over here and go through the monster labor la laboratory. I can't even say what the heck. 
The spirits are taking over my tongue because I can't even say it. We have one, two, three, four tubes of bubbles of death. And we have Mr. Haircut here, young Crouchy. What do you think about the bubbles of death? Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Okay, good interview. Whoa, wait a minute. Look what I see lurking through the cracks right here. Holy crap, guys, yes. It's a punchy. I love this guy so much. I think I've only seen him set up in one other store. I think only one other store. Let's see if we can get him going. No matter what his hair looks like, he always Come looks closer. creepy. I have something to tell you. It's so funny. I promise you'll die laughing. <laughs> Look at this. One of his eyes is really bright. And the other one is really dim. How crazy is that? And look at the size of those meat hooks. <laughs> so this store just opened recently, and I noticed they're still setting things up, so they just brought a berry in. So very soon, he will be hanging from right here. Oh my gosh, guys, we're starting to get flooded with all kinds of friends in here playing with things. They're wearing my stickers and everything. Look at what I see over here. This guy is starting to show up in all the stores now. The five foot Beetlejuice snake. He is so cool because this is like, you can twist this, I think. Yeah, there's a wire inside there. You could twist it around your arm and just have this come up over your neck, just like it's a second head. Wait a minute, I haven't even made it back here yet. <laughs> we gotta look at these other animatronics. All right, we got Betty Sharp here. Let's get her going. Mommy lets me do all the shopping. The, oh, it's funny because, like, she says her little phrase, and if you're just looking at her and listening to what she says, you're totally missing that everything she just chopped is moving around in the bag. I like collecting things. Can I show you my collection? You sure can, <laughs> miss. All right, we got Mr. Jumper here. Let's see if he jumps at us. Yep, there he is. I like how he's kind of back a little bit, so he's not jumping into this thing. Okay, uh, Reagan. I don't know, man. All right, let's do it just because she's here. I don't want to hear your evil phrases. I don't like them. I don't want to hear what you're saying, so I'm going to keep on talking. Okay, spin your head, and let's get it over with. There's a projection in the back. There's the spinning head. I'm getting away from her. All right, let's go through the danger experimental room of electrical death. Will it turn on? Is it gonna turn on? Is it gonna? Okay, here we go. We're getting electrocuted and we get to watch our favorite spirit Halloween movies at the same time. Oh, look what's right outside here, guys. Holy crap, we have two sitting witches. We have a creepy crimson girl on a swing. We have another swinging witch. Did I just call her a swinging witch or a singing rich? A sing I can't even talk. A singing rich. Okay, anyways, look at this, guys. We have a giant, deadly creeper. Oh, my gosh. Okay, and then over here we have a whole plethora. We have a Monty. <gasps> look what we have on the bottom. It's a Betty Sharp. Holy crap, I'm so excited. And two more ginormous deadly creepers. We have a straw man, two, three straw mans. I'm so excited I can hardly breathe. And we have two Grims. Wait, no, we have one Grim and another deadly creeper and a nozzles. Did I say nozzles yet? I don't think I said nozzles yet. We got a nozzles and a skelly bones. And oh my gosh, there's even more stuff over here. And holy crap, I see more cool stuff over here too. Children are going ballistic in here. Wait a minute, look at this. We have some zombie babies. Dang, we are seeing like pretty much the same zombie babies in all the stores. I'm looking for a Little Miss throwing a fit. Look at this. In here we have four of the crawling guys. We have one brain eater. We have one, two, two hand eaters. One, two, three, four, five spider biter billies. And a rat eater. And then, just then, we have this little lady right here who's eating. What are those? Are they cockroaches? I always call these things different things. Ravenous Ruby is her name, but no burrito baby and no Little Miss throwing a fit. However, amongst the creepy dolls, we do have a Hugs, Decrepit Donna, Eerie Emma, Pumpkin Nestor, Rosalie, 
and a Crouchy. Oh my gosh, look, we also have a Uncle Charlie. I have not seen him very much this year at all. In fact, I think I've only seen him in maybe two other stores. One, I put him in a bucket with a whole bunch of stickers. All right, let's look at the inflatables real quick before we move over to those other animatronics. And look at this, they have the coffin. This is the only, only the second store where I've seen that coffin. They also have the cat, they have the haunted tree, they have the hearse down here. This is only the second store where I've seen the wolf. They got the ghost, jack-o'-lantern, reaper, more reapers, scary clown archway, jack-o'-lantern archway, and a gargoyle, and a ghost face. All right, let's make our way over here. I can hear that they have got uh, Mr. Jolly Bottomless Laugher going over there. Man's Possessed Friend, we have one of them right here. Oh, okay, this is for Sitting Scarecrow. It's in the wrong place. I don't even see any Sitting Scarecrows. But the Man's Possessed Friend is 129. Let's put that right there. And then we have a whole bunch of the stuffed dummy props, life-size posable skeletons. Man, I really want to buy one of those straw mans right there. But I won't. I'll leave them for other people since I'm going to so many stores. Wait a minute. Have I ever seen this? The spirit crystal ball with a moon base? That, that's pretty cool. Okay, we do have nozzles here who we haven't looked at yet. Oh, he's talking, but he's not moving. Yes, now he goes. There he goes. He's moving. He was playing a trick on us. And I can hear this laughing Lucky Bottoms, Mr. Bottomless, Bottomless Joe, whatever you want to call him. Let's leave this sir some stickers, and we will leave this sir some stickers. And let's come over here and look at the masks for a minute, because I noticed some scream masks over here. Wouldn't it be so totally awesome if we looked over here and found the blue and the purple ones? And... I don't see them, but I am excited just to see the regular ones. And they did it right. They put them right next to Freddy Krueger and the Texas Chainsaw Massacre Leatherface and all the Halloween masks and Jason Voorhees and Saw. Whoa, wait a minute, guys. Look at this. I have not seen this one anywhere yet. The vintage zombie mask. Have I seen it? I don't think. I think I saw it online, but I haven't actually seen it in stores. Wait a minute, what the heck is this one? What, hold on. Dopey mask. I have never seen this one online or in a store. What's, what, what's up with that little triangle of no hair? <laughs> oh my gosh, there's a couple more that I haven't seen either. Hold on. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. Okay, we have <laughs> a vintage bunny mask, which I have not seen, and... I don't think I've seen this vintage witch mask either. I know they have another vintage witch mask, which I don't see up in this piece at the moment, but this one I have not seen. And what is up with this one, Derpy? That reminds me of the beginning scene of The Dark Knight. Wait a minute, there's another one behind here too. Okay, toxic zombie mask. What in the world, there's, does it, okay. Um, maybe it'll let us try it. Yeah, look at that. He lights up. Now, it's funny because this one's called the Toxic Zombie. And if they have it, which I don't see it. Hold on, let me look over here. Wait, maybe it's over here too. Hold on, let's not give up yet. Okay, well, there is Wacky Mole. But what I was looking for was the other Toxic Zombie mask that is actually a Nozzles mask but for some reason they called him Toxic Zombie. Anyway, so here's this jolly guy. <laughs> oh, here it is, the Toxic Clown. That's what it is. I was totally mistaken. It's not the Toxic Zombie, it's the Toxic Clown, but he does still have the jalapeno nose. Look at these hats. It's like a hat slash mask. Here's the banana hat that Grim had on in the one store. And look at this, we have a noble steed. Then we have a pink flamingo, a pineapple, and a shark. And I am always gonna think about Grim when I see this hat from now on too, because he was wearing this hat in a recent store too. Somebody should put this Rasta Dreadlocks hat on Grim. Man, they are stocked in here, guys. Look at this, they have a ton of sinister spirit dolls. Excuse me, miss, I'm talking. 
a ton of Sinister Spirit dolls, a ton of Chucky dolls, and a couple of these Tiffany dolls. Oh, here we go, guys. This is the other knife that I was talking about, or one of the other ones, the Ghost Face Knife. You don't see these in every store either. When you come in looking for this stuff, you gotta check both sections, the adult section and the kids section, because that's where I found these knives and this knife. All right, let's take a minute to look at these inflatable costumes over here, because these are awesome. Oh my gosh, look at this, guys. I keep making the joke about the noble steed, but here he is, the legitimate inflatable Shrek noble steed costume. Oh, Shrek, was that you? My mouth was open and everything. We've got the inflatable wavy arms alien, which is totally awesome. And look at this. I don't think I've seen this one before. Inflatable circus clown. It's a whole huge, enormous clown. Inflates to six feet tall. I would assume that even in this really hot weather right now, this would be pretty cool because you have a constant flow of air in there. And look at this one, guys. It's an inflatable turkey. What the heck? You could show up at Thanksgiving dinner dressed like that. Inflatable ostrich, inflatable green dino, inflatable teddy bear, inflatable cow, inflatable chicken, and inflatable party pooper. Now, I know I am going to regret not buying this guy. The plush Crouchy, he is so cool. But I don't know, I just, I don't wanna buy them up when I know other people are looking for them. Oh, look at this, guys. They have an awesome selection of vinyl pops, too. We got Chuckles here. We got Billy Butcherson. We have Danny, oh, Danny girl. The pops, the pops are calling. We have the three Sanderson sisters, and we have the glow-in-the-dark Jumbo. Wait a minute, what in the world? Wait, first of all, look at this. They have a Crouchy Magnet and a Nightcrawler Magnet. I don't think I've ever seen those before. Guys, holy crap, look at these little plushes. I don't think I've seen these either. The Wolfman, Pennywise, Chucky, and look at this, look at this, oh my gosh, they have a plush, hold on, I gotta get them out, hold on, a plush Freddy, look at this, holy crap. He is the coolest ever. And look at his little knife hand. There is no way I cannot buy him today. All right, here's a better look at the Chucky. He's wearing his good guy's romper. And they also have this little Beetlejuice. I can't believe I have not seen these in any other store, guys. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. Look, they also have Sonic the, Hed Sonic the Hedgehog. I'm so excited I can't even talk. They have a little SpongeBob. Okay, I... Oh my gosh, I have to buy Spongebob so I can set him in the window of the RV to ride down the street with me. And look at this, they also have a Bob Ross. That is absolutely hilarious. Look, he's holding a happy little tree. All right, let's see what kind of mystery bags they have here. Ooh, they're getting ravaged pretty dang good. All right, we got Trick or Treats. We got My Hero Academia, Naruto. We got Beetlejuice, Chills and Thrills. Horror Properties, Haunted Mansion, what is this, Nightmare Before Christmas, I think I have a whole box of these waiting to be open in the RV. We have the Universal Monsters, and we have these Horror Properties, it's the same one? Yeah, same one as over there. Wait, maybe these are the ones I have that are waiting to be open. These are a little bit different, these are Nightmare Before Christmas, but these are like the hard rubber ones, and these down here are plush. Oh man, now I have to buy more. <laughs> They also have Demon Slayer and, well, just these horror properties. And I don't see any other ones. I don't see, wait a minute. Oh, here's Hocus Pocus right here. Man, am I gonna have to buy this whole box right now? Yep. <laughs> Man, if I do that, I'm gonna have to forego Freddy and SpongeBob. That's kind of a bummer. Decisions, decisions. What would you do, Michael? All right, I have plenty more stores to go to, and if I bought these right now, I would buy every single one. So I'm gonna leave them for other people. I'm gonna go ahead and get the SpongeBob and the Freddy. You're coming home with me, mister. All right, before we go, let's leave some stickers for the bog zombie, and let's leave some for this Mr. Haircut guy. And of course, for Mr. Grimm. There you go. Plenty of stickers for every visiting child. Mm -hmm.